Okay, so I just spent the past half hour or so racking my brain trying to figure out what happened to the stream. Uh, I initially had my mic plugged into the wrong computer, and then when I tried to put it in the right computer, OBS decided to not work at all. So two reboots and a couple other things later, everything's working now, I hope. So, um, because I wasn't even, like, apparently my uh, chat was saying, I can't hear you. Um, so hopefully everything's working now. Uh, everyone that's in the chat, sorry. Um, thanks for sticking around. And, uh, yeah. So, um, to reiterate what I had said previously, <laughs> I'm going to be working on a, a project right now. As you can see, I've got my video editor up um, and running. It's a voiceover narration mix, and there are just certain points of the narration in the soundtrack that are overpower some are that some of it's just too high in volume i mean it's just a lot of volume adjustments um so i'm going to be working on that i purposely lowered the volume in this stream of the project because it is a work in progress so there is that um as i stated before uh, welcome back <laughs> um so the volume of the project that I'm working on is going to be reduced just because it is a work in progress. You'll get to see the final project when it's all done. Um, so normally I end the stream at 830, but I'm going to just I'm just going to go as long as I can, just because I'm going to go at least an hour or so uh, just because we had the late start and I may do another bonus stream tomorrow just to make up for today. With that in mind, I will be doing the RT loot box which i was actually in the middle of opening when i found out everything was going haywire with obs um so this is the july rt box um i got this about two weeks ago it's just because of everything and not streaming for a while uh that's why it's taking this long to open the box and so yeah let's uh try that again <laughs> shall we uh, so it's a back-to-school theme uh, RT box. This is the July box. It's kind of university-esque theme. So the first thing I'm opening up is this t-shirt. And we have... You actually are seeing this before. Rooster Teeth Me Hey, Rooster Teeth Media Club, and I make videos and AMVs and whatnot, so hell yeah, I'm gonna be wearing this one with pride. Um Ooh. Oh, this is the um this is double gold exclusive. This is the stage five pin where Rooster Teeth is located. Um, I think this pin was actually supposed to be in the previous loot box, but there was a, a delay. Yeah, there was. So this was supposed to be in last week, last month's loot box, but uh, you get it now because there was a production mix up or whatnot. So cool, stage five. So that would mean. Achievement Hunter Pennant. I will probably keep this, and if I don't, I know a couple of people who will want this. It does need to get ironed out because it's a little bent. Double gold patch for your Letterman jacket. Did they have Letterman jackets in college? I don't know. Ah, yes. Uh, there is a 
collectible card set for the first 12 boxes or for this year's boxes. Um, this is number six. So I got six halfway there. This is a fun house from the wrestling uh, documentary. So cool. Okay, so this was last month's double gold exclusive, which is a stage five pin. This month's double gold exclusive is another pin. It's Beacon from Ruby. I'm keeping this. You ain't gonna get no. I'm not sharing this one. There are certain things that I don't care for or just don't want, so I give it to my friends or whatnot. You ain't getting this one. Sorry, guys. I'm pausing because of these next two items. Um, I will go ahead and do this one first. College is known about drinking, and you usually drink from my red solo cup. It is a reusable red solo cup. It's a coffee mug. Uh, I can't really see because of the brightness, but it's a coffee mug. A red solo cup coffee mug. Thermos thing. What is what is the exact wording on here say? Reusable red plastic cup with official Rooster, Rooster Teeth logo on it? Oh! <laughs> yeah, Rooster Teeth logo on it. Rooster Teeth University. I'm educated. I'm keeping this. And the reason why I paused was because... It's a bottle opener. Um, a Michael Jones Rage Quit bottle opener. You can yell and scream at you to drink more beer or some other bottled beverage. <laughs> um, I've, I'll hang on to this for now. I, I'll, I'll hang on to this for now, just because I think it's funny. Um, last month's box was a bit of a miss. This this one they knocked it out. Of, like they they did a really good job with this one. I like this. This is funny. So, rage Michael Jones rage quit bottle opener reusable new Rooster Teeth University <laughs> solo cup funhouse trading card which it's the collection which I find in collecting all of them Beacon Academy pin stage five pin uh, double gold patch achievement hunter pennant And a Rooster Teeth Media Club t-shirt. This one I really love. I really enjoy this shirt. I like it. So that is the RT Double Gold Box. Um, so yeah, that was a thing. Man, I can't believe I waited. Man, two, I waited two weeks for you guys. Or for myself. Because of life, I had to wait two weeks to open this thing. And now I'm glad I have finally opened it. Um, I do have a bad habit of looking at my monitor as opposed to the camera. <laughs> I'm so sorry, guys. I'm, it's been a while since I've streamed to a camera, so um, I'm, I'm, I've, I've lost getting used to talking to a camera. And I'm so used to like looking at a screen like, wait, the camera's over here. Okay, there. this is what I've got to look at. Alright, with that in mind, I'm going to go ahead and start editing um, this thing. And I gotta put headphones on so I can listen to it. And again, 
you won't you probably won't be hearing much or it'll be kind of muffled because of the fact that it is a work in progress and where is my keyboard? I'll be working on this. It is an AMA. Feel free to ask me anything. I've, I'll keep my eye out on the chat. Um, and we'll have at this. Okay. All right, so I'm going to go ahead. I don't need to see all these tracks. I just need to see the audio tracks. So I'm going to go ahead and adjust it. So I only see the audio. And if you'll notice um, the slideshow of pictures in the corner, um, th it's those are D and D characters from various campaigns I've played in or ran, both my characters and my fellow players' characters, and some of the NPCs and whatnot. The reason why is because this is a this is this project is related to my D and D stream. which you should catch every Wednesday at 8 o'clock. Well, stream starts at 8 o'clock. Campaign starts around 8.30ish. Um, if you can watch it live, great. Um, you'll get to see it. You'll, there are certain aspects of it, like just the sidebars and the hijinks and the off-topic conversations that you get to, that, that's stream exclusive. Um, after the stream ends, usually all, all Thursday and Friday, I am editing uh the content to just basically focus on the campaign so when you're listening so, so that when it gets uploaded to youtube it's more of like a video or audio drama story so what turns to be a three three and a half hour stream of us playing dungeons and dragons like normal folk gets turned into about a two hour audio story so yeah um, if you can catch it on stream, it's we start streaming at 8 o'clock, campaign starts around 8.30ish, and then we get uploaded to YouTube every Friday around 7pm. So please uh, check it out, and um, if you enjoy it, like it, share it, spread the word. Um, it's a good way to show people what d, &D is all about from a normal person's perspective because there are so many D, &D shows out there like critical role acquisitions inc you know these are people who are professionals and voice actors so you can have that kind of experience don't get me wrong but you can also have the experience that we have which is um not actors <laughs> um and actually, the other players are pretty much their first time. This is this is all for all of, they're very inexplicable. This is their first D and D campaign for the other players. Uh, they have since played other campaigns and adventures since we started uh, back earlier in the year, uh, but they this was kind of their first campaign, so they have that. And, and I'm kind of the ringer of the group because I have the most experience besides the DM. But it, it's been a lot of fun. It's it's a great adventure. Please check it out and enjoy and join us for the ride. All right, so I've got my notes here. Um, so.
Okay, so I'm basically list, uh, like looking at my notes. I'm like, I'm because I've had a couple of people um, kind of help me out because I've like, I've been listening to this thing for days on end. I'm just kind of I know what I'm listening for. I know what the script is, but I'm I was just kind of like I needed kind of an extra set of ears. Like, hey, you're kind of desensitized to this deviation like this part of the soundtrack is over is overpowering the narration so what i'm going through is looking at the notes that they gave that they gave me and, and trying to pinpoint and seeing what i can adjust in terms of the volume of the sound Actually, was anything wrong with that? 105 to 120. And then 120, 30. Well, that's the whole damn thing. Of the Kudoin Empire, to far spots. En route, 
the party was ambushed by a band of goblins. The king took his security to talk to the goblins. He revealed his secret to the attack. I, I have since upgraded. I used to do Camtasia 8. Um, and if you've followed me along, I've, I have... Enjoyed it and then later on started despising it. I have since upgraded to Camtasia 9 and it is actually a. I was reluctant to get it, but I'm glad I did finally cave and upgrade it because the issues I had with Camtasia 8 have been fixed for the most part for Camtasia 9. I say for the most part because there are certain new issues that I found with Camtasia 9 that Camtasia 8 did better. But in the grand scheme of things, Camtasia 9 is so much better than Camtasia 8. Froze. No. Alright. Should be unfrozen.
Man, okay. So, I'm noticing the notes from one of the critics that I asked for. It's pretty much the whole damn thing. While the other person was like, well, here, here, and here. I'm getting this long list. I'm like, we were better off telling me when it wasn't messed up. Like, I'm trying to, I don't know. This is, I'm really questioning this person's equipment now. Like, I'm basically having to do just an overall reducing of everything. Yeah, this is like the only part that was actually okay. Something's not right here because... They're saying this time point is loud, but there's like... You know what? I think it's this is what the problem is.
Alright, we're going to No, we're going to kind of start over here. Because I'm just not... I think I need to remove this track. Okay, so here, 10 second mark to the 18 second mark. And then you're saying in here. To here. And see, this is where I think I'm calling bullshit. Because right here, there's a fade in, fade out. So how is the music being overpowering? I'm sorry, my friend. I, I'm thankful that you, you gave me your opinion on the matter. But now I have to seriously question your critiques. Because you are complaining about issues that there shouldn't be. Because there's a fucking fade in, fade out. Pardon my language. Alright, so I'm going to have to... The 958 mark. That is... Okay, that I'm willing to adjust. And what I can do is just a general reduction in volume.
Yeah, well, we're going to reduce everything by 5%. This is ridiculous. So yeah, I'm just doing a general lowering of everything by just a little bit because the, your, the pers other person's notes just don't make sense to me. Looking at their time codes versus my time codes and I'm like, eh, this is not working. Let me just do a general decrease on the music volume and then figure it out from there. I think this is like the only place that we're not complaining about. Actually, yeah, anything, anything from eight to nine minutes. That goes down. The eight minute mark, we're fine until the nine thirty mark. Right here. Navigating to music volume. Yeah, that makes no sense. It makes no sense. Yeah, and I'm seriously
And I'm going to save this differently. Prologue with soundtrack. Edits. Okay, and that is it rendering. Um, thanks for sticking by. I sorry for the the mix up and the the technical difficulties and even the editing where I'm like I'm looking at the notes from my friends and I'm just like, guys, seriously, what the? Well, I don't understand. Your 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 time codes are not matching up to anywhere on my video because you're saying the music is too loud in this spot. And I'm looking at the time code, and I'm looking at my edits, I'm like, there's no music here. So, um, that's going to take a while to render. And thank you all for coming. Thank you for watching. Um, I don't know about tomorrow, but definitely doing a stream Wednesday for D&D. &D. Swing by, check it out. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.